Hello guys, hello guys, hello guys, how are you? Now, I've come to this video just to tell you one secret of prayer. If you want to apply life to to, to be powerful, you have, to, you have to have a very effective prayer life. You should get some time and go out of the house. Don't only play, pray inside the house. It's good to pray inside the house, but find time to go in a place where you have you come into contact with nature. And then pray in such environments. You'll find the presence of God. You know, you'll be able to experience the power and the presence of God. If you check it, even the Bible, the Bible, the Bible says that Jesus, after he had completed his meetings, used to go somewhere to pray. He didn't go in a certain room. He went to a certain place, in a certain environment, just to pray and to spend time in the presence of God. So it's very, very important. Make it a habit. There are so many prayer mountains around. You can go and see the place is beautiful. There's an ocean behind me. There's an ocean behind me. So find time. Find time to go and pray outside. Outside your house. Have a prayer ret retreat. You know, go out. Uh, there are very many prayer mountains in different parts of the world. Find time and go there. Seek the face of God. The face of God. Pray fast there. There are no distractions. But the problem when you fast in your house, somebody comes and knocks on the door. They want something from you or maybe it's somebody important whom you can't ignore has come to visit you. You see? And that's the time you had set aside to spare to, to you know to fellowship with the Holy Spirit. But now there are so many distractions, you can't even focus. This right is usually to go somewhere far from your comfort zone, a place like this where you can pray and seek the face of God. So that in, in such environments you can have encounters. And make sure when you go to such places to pray, you, are, you cover yourself with the blood of Jesus, you know, and always contact the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus so that you can have sweet fellowship. All those people, you, you read the Bible, the Isaiah, the Jeremiah's, all of them, this is where they used to pray. Not uh, specifically here. They used to pray in the mountains, in the gardens. Even Jesus prayed in the garden of Gethsemane. That's a secret I'm telling you. Make it a habit and you'll see your prayer life will change. That ministry will grow. Your business will grow. Find time, even if you're a, you're a businessman, you're a, a, a mother, a father, find time. Go outside and pray for your family. It's very important. You'll see how your prayer life will increase and your intimacy with God will increase. So guys, thank you. I love you so much. Don't forget to subscribe to this, to this channel and um, continue sharing my videos. And uh, those who are donating to my channel, may God bless you. If you want to donate, use the information in the description box or in the comment section, chapter below. See you in the next video.